and they're standing Filipinos through body language. In Filipino culture, the use of body language and hand gestures are very common in daily communication. If you are an expat living in the Philippines, you would want to familiarize yourself with these common gestures to avoid any misunderstanding. Here are a few common forms of nonverbal communication and what they mean in the Philippines. First is mano or pagmaman. Mano is the Spanish word for hand, while po is a Filipino term used as a sign of respect. It is done by taking the hand of the elder and gently tapping it to one's forehead while saying, Mano po. This is usually done by someone younger to show some respect to the elders and as a way of accepting a blessing from them. Next is lip pointing. Instead of lifting a hand or finger or arm, which uses unnecessary energy, Filipinos sometimes use their pouting lips to point at a certain object or direction instead. Many foreigners find this funny and confusing, but this gesture is very common and unique to Filipinos. When you see a Filipino do this, don't confuse it with an invite for a kiss. Third is the nodding and raising eyebrows with a smile. This is one way of how Filipino greet each other in a casual and quick way. Acknowledging that you saw that person. This gesture is sometimes followed with a friendly tap in the shoulder if they are within reach. Fourth is the arms extended while lowering the head. These gestures are commonly done when passing in front of two people talking to each other or crossing a room when someone's watching a TV, followed by an excuse me. This gesture is seen as a sign of courtesy and respect. Next is drawing a rectangular or square shape in the air using the hands. This is commonly done by the Filipinos in restaurants when asking for a menu or a bill. To get the waiter's attention, Filipinos tend to make a square shape in the air with their hands high in the air to ask for the menu and a rectangular shape for the bill. Next is silent looks, which is the last part of the body language. It is usually when Filipino parents give this very eyes silent look to their child. It automatically means that the child should stop whatever he or she is do doing. This is done and this is a w one way of Filipino parents to warn or control their children in public without negatively catching many people's attention.